Hey 128 uh, guys and gal, this is your airlock tour. Uh, this is the big picture. I'm going to start out in the crew lock, go through there and then I'll work uh, forward side, port side, aft, uh, deck and then overhead. Looks a lot like building 9. The, uh, the bags are configured uh, per the uh, message 20-732 uh, that you guys sent. Thank you very much. And compare that to the back that has uh, information from your task, um, your task information. So anyway, this is the setup. The, uh, the staging bag has the two fist stringers as prescribed. Um, stringer one is the one that's hooked to the outside hooks. And stringer two is on the inside hooks. And stringer one is placed uh, primarily in front. We've labeled the bags according to uh, your tasks. A for ATA, P for um, pass, H for PMA3, and then the R is for uh, RPCM, and that is in a green mesh bag, which is inside the large RU bag. The uh, small RU bag is configured as you guys want and uh, the one delta hopefully you guys get the information we only have 10 adjustables total so we have five inside the smaller U bag and we've added an additional ret so you should have two rets in there as well the uh, routing for the umbilicals is per the procedure if you guys have a better idea on what you'd like to do be more than happy to adjust fire on that uh, this is per the procedure Going forward, ATUs, Nicole's EMU, and uh, as you guys uh, had asked, the items that you'll have on your mini workstation are just placed there, so uh, you guys can configure that as you wish once you get here. We have plenty of wire ties, they're configured as you guys had asked, but if you need more, there are plenty. We have uh, 27 longs and probably an equal number of shorts. Cabling in this upper right hand corner is kind of messy. We'll see what we can do to make it better, but it's it's suboptimal at best. Try to just keep it out of the way. So now we're looking port, and this is probably the best place for us to have our computers. On the left hand side is PCS, right hand side is SSC. It seems to keep uh, both computers out of the way, but still have them accessible. The monobacumeter is not in here yet, but we will bring it in here, and typically it's stowed in this uh, back aft port corner and then we have a couple egg timers set up for you all. We try to keep the, the uh, joint emergency egress card and any other emergency cards out of the way because what typically happens is they get bumped and they start to fly. So the best thing to do is to find a place where everybody knows where it is but also is probably not going to get knocked and have it uh, flying away like things tend to do here. Equipment bag. We like to keep the uh, PBAs stashed in this area. You see the, the red plastic, that's typically where the extra ones will go. We'll have one per crew member in here and we'll keep those inside the airlock throughout your mission. Dane, this is not your EMU, but it does have all of your sundry items from your mini workstation stashed here, and uh, then we'll replace it once you bring in your EMU. Servicing kit is right now back in this starboard aft corner.
deck is a pretty convenient place to uh, stash things with the bungees, although things tend to get knocked and float away. Um, Maddox canisters typically will stage those there or overhead, which we'll see in a second. And we have PWRs below these panels, as well as a degassing tool or kit. Go overhead. I guess the primary thing of interest for you guys overhead is going to be this uh, MO2 bag, which is MO2 uh, 1038. It's where we keep Medox canisters and batteries. And I forgot to mention that uh, usually the uh, PGT batteries, the charged ones, we keep in a green mesh bag. I've stashed it right above the SSC right now. We can probably find a better place for it, but typically we just try to keep that in a bag and we'll get those charged up as we need them. So we go back for one big overview of the airlock. That's generally it. I've taken a series of pictures as well, which I'm going to have downloaded today. And that should give you an idea of how things are located. You can reference those. And we are happy to configure this however you guys want. And uh, I guess I can show you out front as well where we have some things stashed. And just right now I have the two primary masks located just outside the hatch, but they'll need to come inside obviously for primary operations. I have uh, the large ORU bag stashed on the deck in node one. Mike is working out on A Red. Say hi, Mike. Hurrah. Hurrah. <laughs> Go A Red. Arr. A Red strong. What we did last time was place the uh, ECOX against this wall and bungee them. I think we may do the same thing again, but just add some bungees so that we don't have any issues with respect to uh, those floating away. And uh, that's pretty much how we're planning on configuring items for your EVAs. Any questions, please let us know, and we will be happy to accommodate. We're really looking forward to seeing you guys. You guys are going to have a blast. It's awesome up here. See ya.